What's up guys, it's Rowan and welcome back to this week's video. We're just gonna jump into this one really quick. So, when I was a newbie, something that I noticed myself doing was going onto YouTube and looking up certain quests, either for the assistance or just for the enjoyment of watching it and how entertaining it was. So that being said, I think that I'm gonna start recording certain quests that I think are the most fun or helpful, which in my opinion, those are the dark core missions and the soul riding missions. If you guys have any other quests that you guys think I should record, let me know down in the comments. But for today, we are going to be doing the first Dark Core mission. I think it's super fun, and I hope that you guys enjoy. Let's get into it. So we're going to start over here in Moorland, meeting Alex. Tell your brother Isa I love him and miss him. Thanks. I actually think that you talk to someone else first to get the little gun in the corner over there, but I can't remember who. Sorry. So we're going to be putting our horse on the boat over here, and I don't know about you, but this feels really unsafe. Like, this just seems like a really unstable plan. <laughs> Isn't she just the absolute cutest? Bye! Okay, next we have to hide ourselves, and I honestly don't really understand why I have to do that. Like, can someone tell me why I can't just get on the ship and not hide in a fridge? Like, what? Wait, several hours? <laughs> Where do I go to the bathroom? May I just say that this place looks way too pretty to be evil. Alright, so we've arrived and it looks like we have to go find our horse. I don't really know what happened to her. <laughs> she just vanished. I remember doing this quest when I had Alice and I remember it being so difficult. But I honestly think that I was just naive and young and maybe it's not as hard. Though I will admit, I think I'm doing it wrong. All right, while he's not looking, we're gonna book it. Wait, <laughs> I just stood up, I, what? All right, man, we're booking it, okay? We're just gonna go for it. I don't know how I didn't fall right there, but we're just gonna run. We're gonna go over here, we're gonna click the button, and clearly I overestimated this quest. Why did I think that this quest was gonna be easier this time? <laughs> I'm not even that much older than I was last time I played this game. All right, you guys, I see the end. We're almost there. <laughs> I don't understand how this happens. All right, after like the 50,000th time we've tried this, we finally made it through, we're going up the stairs, and <laughs> I'm really hoping that this, the rest of this quest is easy. For anyone wondering what is to the right when you first go up the stairs, maybe you didn't check, um, I looked for you. <laughs> it's nothing special, so it's not worth it. Just don't.
this point there should be a little ledge that you can run up to save you some trouble um but you know i'm not i'm not the best at this game so let's see how this goes Once again, I wanted to see what was on the other side since I've never looked before. <laughs> Once again, it's nothing, so don't trouble yourself. At this point, I almost peed because I thought I was going to be trapped and screwed, and my fiancé even told me that I was going to die, so... But it's okay, because we made it. Can I just say that this is definitely not something that a teenage girl for a horse summer camp would be doing at all <laughs> like this is some adult stuff <laughs> so we found my horse <laughs> and I'm running up to it and I just they're right there do they not see me and then they talk for what seems like forever and I'm not gonna tell you what they're gonna say if I'm being honest I skipped over pretty much all of it you guys can read the storyline get your first experience for it on your own. By the way, <laughs> why does Justin look like he's high as a kite? Like, <laughs> Then somewhere along that storyline that I did not pay attention to at all, we apparently get caught and now we have to do a race, so that's, that's fun. Um, if I'm being honest, this is probably the hardest race I've ever had to do on SSO just because there are so many sharp turns and you still want to go at fast pace but you keep running into things and it's honestly really hard, so good luck. Here is the perfect example of a sharp turn. My horse decided that she wanted to fall. <laughs> but surprisingly, we actually lived and we made it in time to the next checkpoint. At this point, I missed my jump, I fell, and I tried to go into the water to get back up, but it didn't get me up um, to the top again, it just made me get up right here, so that meant that I had to go up the stairs, and unfortunately, my timer ran out as I was going up the stairs, um, so, so that was fun, and uh, I had to start over, even though the last checkpoint was literally right there. But I learned from my mistake and I finally managed to get the jump down after doing the race at least three more times. And I assume we are now on our way back home to Jorvik. Then you're gonna go over here back in Moorland and talk to Alex about what you saw. Just kind of give her a summary. And she's gonna ask you to go to Vlendale or however you say it, Vellendale, I don't really know. And talk to Elizabeth and basically just give her a summary as well. Then after talking to Elizabeth, you are going to go to the stone circle and go around it, go into the portal, and you're going to talk to Frith and the others. And once again, it's just going to be a really long storyline. I personally didn't pay any attention to it just because I've already done this before and so I can't give you a little summary of what it is. I'm sorry, but if you do this quest, I want you to have that experience on your own um, and have the fun with doing it by yourself. 
Why is his face so close? And that's going to wrap up this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. I know this video was a bit different than what I usually do. I'm just trying to get a variety of everything, such as role plays, training times, quests, and other fun videos, just so that everyone can have something that they like to watch. For our shoutouts this week, we are going to be having two. They are going to go to Tower X Love and Esme Dawn Water. So make sure to go give them a follow on Instagram. Let me know in the comments down below if you have any quests that you would like me to make videos into and I'll get started on them. I hope you guys have a great weekend and I'll see you next week.